Hi, and welcome to Meme Samurai. In this video, I'm going to show you just a few of the things that you can do with the Meme Samurai software. When you open the software, this is exactly what you're going to see. I'm just going to explain a few of these icons, and I'm going to show you what you can do. First thing you want to do is look for a background image. Now, you can go anywhere on your computer. We do provide you with over 100 images for you to use to get you started, but obviously you can download them from the internet and then upload them to the Meme Samurai. So this is the initial image. You can add text. You can make the text different colors. Or you can give it a stroke so it would be filled in like that. You can add as many of these different sets of text as you want. You can also skew them. So you could then put another one over here. You can put them upside down if you want. Down here we've got a space for your domain. You can either decide to have that or not. Obviously you can still put your domain URL in normal text and add it to the image. It's just an option for you. We then want to add a second image. Again you select it. Let's use the cow picnic. As you can see, that's a little bit too small. Just click on it and zoom. If you want to add some more text to that, you can do. Make it a different colour again. Oh, that should be love, not low. And let's make it a little bit bigger. You can add a speech bubble. And if you decide you want it to be the other way, just change it. You can move this text around and if you want to edit it just click on it and edit. You can also add arrows. Now these are good for calling attention to your URL or to whatever call to action you may use. You again you can drag these around and if you click on it it changes the direction of the arrow. You can add as many arrows and speech boxes and bits of text as you want. Really is that simple. And then you just save it. If you decide that you don't like this, that you want to change it, just delete. And to delete the arrow, you just do shift click. So you would just delete the words. And to get rid of this middle image, shift click. And then go down and add a different image. As you can see, you can actually see the images you're going to be working with here, which makes it a lot easier, because uh, I know some people don't always name their images something that is memorable. There you go, and you've now got a second image to use. So again, you can just save this. You can have it with the Earl or without. There you go. That is exactly how you would use Meme Samurai. You can see how simple it is. It will work on PCs and it will work on Macs. Inside the Members area, you get full access to the software, to all the images that we've created, which is over 100 right now. We've got some for the holidays. We've got some funny ones. We've got some silly ones. We also show you how to find images, websites to go to where you can get images that you can use. We also have training sections in there. So we'll show you how to upload to Pinterest, how to make the image clickable. We'll show you how to use Google+. We'll show you some places to find 
ideas for memes. We also show you how to use Facebook, how to set up a page and how to monetize it. My partner on this project Rob is very into Facebook and he has put together whole training sets showing you how to monetize your Facebook pages and memes can be a big part of that. Now remember you can use these images anywhere. You can use them on Facebook, Pinterest, Google Plus, you could use them on LinkedIn, you could use them on your website. That's enough for now. I'll see you in the members area and remember it's a one-off payment and you get everything. Free updates and uh, any ongoing training that we add and bonuses you will get all those free for just a one-off payment.